Little Miss Banksy. Don't even think about it. I wasn't. I thought I told you to get lost. You don't get it. My dad's a good person. He doesn't deserve this. She has to stop the charges. Well, it's not happening, so do one. You don't know him. I don't have to. I know his type inside out. He explained. He paid her. Nobody forced us to do anything. No, but he filmed it. Without her knowing and used it as blackmail. You're lying! No, he's lying! He's lied to you your whole life because that is who he is. He's a disgusting, sick, perv of a man who takes what he wants, throws a few quid at the damage and moves on. And finally, it's catching up with him. And I'm telling you this. He deserves every slow, miserable year behind bars he's got coming. Tell your mum to let him rot. You've just missed Vanessa. She's gone to drop Johnny at the Charminers. Well, I came to see you, actually. There'll be a drink behind the bar waiting for you when you're done. Thank you. Pretty sure I'll need one. Well? He got four years for blackmail and harassment on two counts. The other girl was there as well. She was amazing. We're going to keep in touch. And the judge gave him a right telling off. That is great. Good for you, babe. Got the bubbly on ice, as promised. Oh, do you know what? I think I'm just going to head home. I'm sorry, what? She's turning down free booze. Houston, we have a problem. <sighs> I'm okay. It's a good thing. I wanted him put away, but... It just stings a bit, doesn't it, having it all dragged up again? <sighs> you can say that again. Where's your dad and Ness? Our dad had to rush off to take Eliza to an appointment and um Rona just grabbed Vanessa about some better things. So. Have a fair. Wait there, please. Marlon, you're up. Come on, let's get you home. Here. They didn't really go through that much, just the facts. His solicitor made a big deal about Phil being self-employed. Needing to support his family, his daughter. Hey, don't sweat it. Him being locked away is a blessing to that kid. He kept saying that Phil was a different person back then. That he should only be judged on the blackmail, not his past mistakes. He didn't assault you, did he, back then? No. He was just a creepy weirdo. Well, there's no law against that, unfortunately. But he isn't different, he's the same. Worse, if anything. And it wasn't just... The blackmail was it? It was the way he made me feel about what I did. Hey, don't give him what he wanted. Don't you dare. Jacob. Ugh. Put the tally on, you've made the news. Who attempted to blackmail two women has been jailed for four years today. The conviction came as a result of a new initiative by Hotton Police to support vulnerable witnesses and crack down on this type of crime. Detective Inspector Mark Bales had this to say. Unfortunately, in recent years, we've noticed an increase in these uh, cases. Offenders trying to restore money by obtaining images online or otherwise that the victim would prefer to keep private. Uh, I hope the success of this investigation sends a message that we take these offences seriously, that we will prosecute, and we'll do our utmost to protect anyone who comes forward to report these crimes. Thank you. <sighs> wow. That really makes it all seem worth it when he puts it like that. That's who handled the case, then? D.I. Bales? Yeah. He's been brilliant. 